We're going to use the app Stop Motion Animation today. If you open up your Stop Motion Animation, you can just hit the arrow at the top to get back to this page. This is the home page. You're going to hit the plus sign to start a new movie. Now, when you start taking pictures, you're going to make sure that your camera is straight over your base and you don't see anything on the sides. If you want to focus it, just place your finger someplace on the image. We're going to make this little piece crawl across our page. So what we need to do is place this in just a little tiny bit, then hit the red button. We'll move it forward, hit the red button. Every time that I'm moving it, I make sure to get my hands out of the way before I take my next picture. I'm using fabric or felt on another piece of fabric, which is allowing me to make my fabric kind of bend up like what you see. So I can use my fingers to kind of bend it up and it's holding on kind of like Velcro, but not that tight. I'm taking little pictures as I move across my page. If you're doing this with a partner, you want to make sure that you have good communication. One person is moving it with their hands, then they say, okay. And the next person takes a picture and says, okay. If you accidentally get a hand in there, it's nothing to panic about. Press on the image down below that you want to get rid of. This will pop up and you hit delete. Now you can continue through until your um, object moves all the way across the page. In my example here, that's my goal, is to make it go all the way across the image. And we'll go just a little further. And then one more of nothing. If I want to see what that looks like, I hit the play button. And there we have it walking across the green grass. I'll stop it and show you that we can speed this up or slow it down. If I want it to go faster, one second is what this would take. I can move this scroll bar over and watch how fast it can go. If I want it to slow down, again, I move it to the minus. Ooh, that's really slow. You can see that there is a little bit of a finesse to try to find the exact speed that makes it look the best. So I think it was really nice right where it was at two or three seconds. This is a super short movie. Yep, that's where I would bring it to. I'll stop it. I can hit the arrow back. That brings me back here. And then I'm able to share this in many different ways. Through YouTube, I can save to camera roll. Um, and if I save to camera roll, then I can upload it to my Google Docs. So that is stop motion animation in a very, very quick tutorial.